Hello, hello everybody. It's Stephanie with Coco and Alley Boutique and Crafting Page. Um, everything I have here, or almost everything, is Dollar Tree. I have one of the spiders, one of the creepy cloths, and a spider web. Now this stuff I did buy last year. Hi Joanne, hi Steven. But I looked on their website to make sure that they're going to have it again this year, and it's all listed, so you should be able to find it all this year as well. And then I've got my Waverly Chalk Paint and Plaster, if y'all want to see that. So, and then my little hang tag. Hi, Justin, or Justine, I'm sorry. Y'all are half blind. Please forgive me. So what we're gonna do is um, we're gonna start with our web. We're gonna deconstruct it. First thing I'm gonna do is pull this spider off. He just comes right off. He was just on there with a little bit of glue. Keep your spider though. You might wanna use it for something else. I just don't want it for this project. And then we're just gonna start pulling off this tinsel. Do y'all like tinsel? I'm not a tinsel lover. I know some people are, but I'm not. I mean, a little bit of it's okay, but I don't like a lot of it. What you doing, Justine? Well, let me see. And y'all, this just pulls right off, so just some of it may, may get a little... Um, tough, but you can get it off. Okay, let me clean this off real quick. All right, so once you get that done, see how I don't have any more tinsel. I'm using my Waverly um, chalk paint in the color plaster. Um, and I'm not gonna put like a heavy coat on here cause I don't have time to sit here and wait for it to dry. I'm just going over it. It does not have to be perfect, as I always say. It does not have to be perfect, just cute. I just don't want it to be so black because I'm putting that white creepy cloth over it. So I just want it to be a little bit, um, a little bit lighter.
Okay, so see how it's not so dark anymore? That's all I was going for. Was I don't want it so dark. So now I'm just going to take the creepy cloth and wrap it over this. And this is 32 by 72 inches, so I probably won't use the whole thing. Just take the packaging off of it and then unfold it. It's kind of like a cheesecloth. So if you can't find this, you can use cheesecloth. You can get cheesecloth anywhere, Walmart, Hobby Lobby. Yeah, I'm definitely not gonna be using all of it. Let me cut it down. All right, y'all, so I'm just gonna put some little dots of glue here and there, and then I'll trim it, the, the cloth around the spider web just to hold it on but y'all see I just laid it laid it over it paint still wet and all it doesn't matter it's not gonna hurt anything and I'm just I'm not even gonna lift this back off I'm just gonna kind of put a dot of glue and stick this to it And again, that's what it looks like. I'm gonna go ahead and start cutting around the edge of it, of the frame. And y'all, this stuff is really easy to cut. All right, so y'all see? Doesn't that look cuter than just a tinsel spider web? I think it does. I think it does. Okay, and then the next thing we're gonna do is just take our spider that I got at Dollar Tree. Thank y'all for sprinkling and for the hearts. I appreciate y'all. And now I'm just gonna um, glue this spider on and I'm probably just gonna glue it right in the center at an angle. I need more glue though. Camille, are you, when's your big move day? Are you still going through stuff and packing? So just put some glue on there and stick it wherever you want it. Yeah, he's a big creepy spider. That's right. Thank you for sprinkling. Thank y'all. Y'all are so sweet. Okay. See, it's 
see y'all isn't that cute and that's one to stick up let me put an, a dot of glue right here all right and then um so i got that done and the last thing is just a hang tag and i'm just gonna write creepy on it with my black sharpie And then I'm going to see. And now I'm going to tie it. Um, let's see where they're going to tie it. Oh, wow. That's exciting, though, Justine. Five years on the outside. It must be beautiful. Long scissors. All right, y'all. That's that's it. Y'all have to give me hearts for that. Isn't that cute? So that's all I came on here for was to show y'all how to do that. Um, I hope all of y'all have a great night and a good day tomorrow. And it's almost the weekend. So I'll talk to y'all later. Love you guys. Bye-bye.